Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon White. In the last episode, we explored the Pichu Laboratory and this huge ass route that just never, ever, 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 ever ends. And thankfully, this episode it is gonna end. So yay. Also, the dubious disc. You guys may be wondering what that does. I believe it evolves Porygon into Porygon Z, uh, or Porygon 2 into Porygon Z. One of those two. I don't know how the Porygon evolutions work. I've never used them. But, um, a lot of people think Porygon 2 is better than Porygon Z anyway, so... I mean, I guess it's just a matter of opinion. Alright, so this takes us back here. Which is not where we want to go, because there are two battles we missed. So, I think I can get to those by going this way instead. Uh, it looks like, no, that's going to take me back to the same place I was at. So, maybe this way? Cruiser Burger! Nope, gonna take me same place too. Alright, fine. And this is the way we went before. There we go, that's gonna do this. You know what, actually, no, there are no more trainers. The other trainers we fought were on the lower end. So now we can blow this popsicle stand. Uh, looks like. Yeah, we're done here, I think. Alright, let's get out of here. Where is this gonna take us? Aha, yes, here we are. Perfect. Nice little shortcut back to the entrance there. So there is a little area I missed, you guys may notice. There's a battle girl over there and an item. I don't know what item it is. It's, uh... Oh, yeah, it's TM32 Double Team, but it looks like the only way you can get over there is... It says after you finish the main story, so I'm assuming there's something that opens up there that allows that to happen. Now, did my repel run out? I'm... Oh, no, I reused it. Okay. So I don't have fly with me, so I'm going to have to go to... I do have a fly sleigh, by the way. I caught one off screen a while ago. It was a tranquil. So I just used that to go from town to town for the surfing spots in between them. And then I just put my team back on because we need all of them. As you can see, these battles are kind of rough. So we're going to head back to our base of operations. See if I can get through this grass without a battle. There we go. Our base of operations accumula town here. So we are done with that surf spot. I am going to uh, heal up, even though I don't think I need to, because I didn't battle anybody else. But that swimmer did do a number on me, I guess. And now we are going to go to our next area where we need to do something. It's actually right here, so I'm not even going to... I'm not going to need my fly slave, and I'm really not going to need anything, because it's just a really simple spot and a really simple item. You might remember this. Oh, look, this is where Getsus did his little speech. Uh, but it's actually here on Route 2, right past Accumula Town. Right at the beginning, super easy to get. It's right here, we just got a nice little strength spot. A uh, little strength boulder that we had to skip. Because we did not have strength at the time, but now we do, so there you go. Push the boulder in the hole, and we get a free rare candy. If this was any lesser of an item, I wouldn't even bother coming here for it. But rare candies are somewhat useful in the right situation, so I did get it. Alright. So now, back to Accumula, and I think I'm going to need my Fly Slave for the next place we're going to go. Yes, because our next goal is Striaton City, which is the next city in the game from Accumula, I think. At least I, as far as I remember. So let's get Tranquil out of here, and, uh, yeah. Tranquil move. Party. We'll just switch him with Avion for now. It really doesn't matter, because we're going to just take him back out once we get there. Stratton City actually has a surf spot within the town. You may remember if you guys remember Stratton City. I don't blame you if you don't, because I don't really rem I didn't really remember it either until I looked up for the surf spots. So yeah, Tranquil Fly to... Uh, is it? Ooh, yeah, it is the next one, okay. Yeah, and then there's Nacreen City where we fought the, uh... Lenore, the gym leader Lenora. Lenore. And we met House. Alright, so let's just go get the surf spot real quick. The items here are pretty shitty, but I figured I'd show it off to you guys anyway, so... Um, we're gonna need our dowsing machine, I think, because there are some hidden stuff. Yes. Alright, so we got some surf spots over here in this little, like, mixed-up garden thing. Some, you know, usually you don't even remember this, but... Alright, so hidden item here. And it's a zinc. Well, those are nice, you know, if... Even if you don't want to use the hidden items, the... Or what am I trying to call them? The vitamins. Even if you don't want to use them, it's still good to get them because they're worth $4,900. I mean, they cost $9,800 to buy, so it's like, yo, whoa. It's kind of worth it. All right, over here, this might be a battle. This guy might want to fight us, but I have a feeling he just wants to give us something. 
I might be wrong, but we'll find out, I guess. Yeah, he does want to give us something. A big pearl. There you go. Those are worth a considerable amount of money. So there you go. Let's see what else there is to get here. I don't know if you can even get in any battles in this water here. It looks different than all the other water, but maybe you can. Maybe. I'm sure you can. Alright, let's see what we got. What's over here? Uh, doesn't look like a damn thing. No hidden items or anything? Really? Huh. Oh, well, you can just walk over here. I guess that's why it makes sense. Um, anything over here? It doesn't look like it. There's a patch there, but there's nothing on it. No hidden item or anything, so... That's it for Stratton City. So, our next destination that has something is Route 3. And Route 3 is not... that. This is Route 2, right? Route 2, yeah. That's where we got the Strength Boulder. So, all of our stuff's right here in a row. I guess I could have technically just run across the city if I wanted to. It would have been faster instead of flying. But then Route 3, we've got quite a few surf spots here. And there's actually a surf spot that is... What? What? Oh, you know what? I think I still have my Scraggy and my Dragonite in there. Holy shit. <laughs> well, oh well, I don't really care about them. Um, they can stay in there as long as they want. Uh, there's a few surf spots here in Route 3. The first being... Uh, well, actually... They're not the other one isn't technically in Route 3, it's off of Route 3. So here are the surf spots, this big little lake here. You remember this place? So there's some stuff going on here, I think. I don't think I have a rappel going. Indeed, I do not. So what do we got? A shitty Basculin. Oh, wow, what a surprise. Get off my doorstep, Basculin. Why do I have Tranquil in front? So stupid. Alright, let's get this item here. This is full heal. I mean, are these really worth it, arguably, for how little time they take? Yes, I guess, but... Um, let's switch... Crash in front. You know, I could just use a rare candy crash to the level he needs to get to, but I've used too many on him already. I think I want to use it on Avion. He needs it more anyway. So there's a hidden item over here, according to the dousing machine. Oh yeah, we haven't been over here before. I need to use a max repel. Use max spell. Okay, I guess that's one way to get into the item menu without uh, without having to kill my dowsing machine. Hey, look at that, a rare candy. And we've got a breeder over there. I'm not too happy about that. Please stop looking this way. Thank you. And a HP up. I was going to say PP up. I thought that's what it was, but no, it was not. Alright, let's just see what's going on over here. Looks like nothing. Ah, uh, bitch spotted me. I knew it. She's going to have like 20 million Pokemon. No, she'll only have three. This game's not that bad about it. Told you, three. Oh yeah, these are going to be strong though, because you need Surf to get over here. But you know what? Crash can handle it. Now that he's got his full moveset, he's totally beast up. Ice Punch, baby. I knew he was going to use Leer. I should have Dragon Danced. Should have Dragon Danced, but you know what? Ice Punch might even do it. Because I'm that much stronger than him. Nope. You've received a new question. Swipes. You would get a crit, wouldn't you? Alright, see you later, Stimmy Sage. Is she going to have all the Simmies? Because if so, that would be pretty boss. But at the same eh, Actually, no, it would just be pretty boss without any butts, because I'd get boss experience. She does! Show sure enough. Uh, what are, yeah, you know what? I'll try my luck. Just because Crash needs the levels here, nobody else on my team does, except Avion, who for some reason I left in the box because I forgot. I didn't know there were battles over here. Or a battle. Dude, enough with these crits on Fury Swipes! Fucking two crits? Slut? Die. Damn, yo. Okay, for some reason all these guys are faster than me too, so I am gonna die next turn. Unless I use my last healing item. Remind me when I get back into town, guys, to buy some healing items. Max Potion for the Wizzle. Lick! Dude, I just healed and you're really gonna paralyze me? Oh, a crit and it didn't paralyze, that's funny. Alright, see you later, bitch. I'll, uh, here come the crit fury swipes. No, wow. This guy's really unlucky. There you go, and is that gonna get us to 39? Is it? Is it gonna do it? 
Yes, baby! You're about to see something very, very good. Yes, you are, people. Prepare for Crash's epic evolution into my second favorite Pokemon of all time. Here it is! The moment we've been waiting for! What? Crash is evolving, huh? Ing? No more holding those pants up, dude. Because they will hold themselves up. Uh, uh, uh. And here he is, the hoodlum Pokemon, Scrafty. Or Scrashty, you know, Scrashy, whatever you want to call him. There he is, look at him, he's munching on something. This guy is just so hood, he's so gangster. This is a present for you. Oh, it's a Lumberry, thank you. Yay, so now all of our team has Evolvagia, except for Paravion. That bastard. And we get a max ether, okay, so. That's all that's going on over here. Let's see the other what's on the other side of the bridge. I think it's just a regular item. Let's check it out. The water is a deep blue. Okay, so now that that's all done, I need to go get Avion back, man. Dude, there ain't shit over here. Alright, so the other surf spot I was talking about on Route 3 isn't on Route 3, it's uh, connected to Route 3. It's in Wellspring Cave where we caught our Slowflake. Remember that? Our second teammate? Yeah, you can only explore like a little bit of that cave, but you needed Surf to explore the rest of it, so um, now we can do that. Wellspring Cave, th trust me, there's not much to explore. It's still a pretty small place. So what I'm going to go do is I'm going to go exchange Tranquil for Avion because we need him now. Because he is gotta level up and stuff. Alright, let's just switch Tranquil first, and then we'll heal. And I need us PC, move Pokemon. Where's my Avion? There you are, you underleveled bitch. Fur Tranquil, there we go. And we're gonna come back and need to get him after this, because the next place we need to go after this is Lost Lorn Forest. Oh, uh, we've got quite a bit, few places to go. The only other place we need to go that has a lot of exploration, though, is uh, Mistralton Cave. That place is gonna be interesting. Alright, so let's head to Wellspring. Wait, let's get my Avion set up first. Avion, alright. You need to get. Well, I guess he's not that under leveled. He's only one level under. Uh, look, these guys are under leveled, but they're evolved. So right now we're just working on evolutions. So after Avion evolves here, everybody's going to be in their final form except for Hydrus. And Hydrus, I can just evolve with the Thunderstone. He's already ready. But I haven't looked at his moveset uh, plans that I have written down yet. I was supposed to do that in between episodes, but I forgot, so. I guess I'll do that in between this and the next episode. Decide if he's ready to evolve or if he Electric learns any moves that I would like him to continue learning. Before he evolves into Electros, because once he evolves into Electros, then it's... Do I already have a Max Repel up? No, I don't. Then it's the same situation as um, Tynamo. Both Electros and Tynamo don't learn any moves via level up. So, um, all the moves they learn that evolution line learns is as electric. He learns all the moves. But the thing about Tynamo is Tynamo can't learn any HMs almost. So, you know, he's like a Magikarp. He doesn't learn anything and he doesn't learn any TMs, although Magikarp does learn some moves. But uh, Electros, the thing that's cool about him is he can learn H TMs. He can learn TMs and HMs. He can learn a lot. A lot of good ones. So, he's actually useful. He's actually worth a damn. Uh, where's that hidden item? Oh, right here, where I couldn't get, naturally. PP up. So, um, yeah, all of the other moves we want him to learn that are going to be in Electros' moveset are via TM, so it won't matter to evolve him. Thunderbolt was the only thing I was waiting for. That is the only thing I was waiting for. Alright, and it's an escape rope. Okay, and Wellspring Cave does have a lower flow here, and it has some battles, that's why I brought Avion. Also, it's dark, so I'm going to need to use my book here to figure out where the hell I'm going. So, Wellspring Cave. Here it is. Man, it's dark in my room, too, so I can't see shit. Ugh, I need to turn my light on. Going to turn the light on. Light's on. Okay. This lower floor is actually kind of huge. So, we want to go up here. There's a staircase. There we go. Oh, there's an item, too. Let me get that first. Okay, where am I? Uh... Actually, there's nothing over here, except for a hidden item. There we go. Other than that, there's nothing over on this area here. There's an item, but it's past a ledge, so we gotta go back. Gotta go up. 
Oh, there's another hidden item. Okay, and there's two surf spots here and a brute wall land bridge in the way. So let's go to the surf spot. This is going to lead to that item. I have a feeling it's going to lead to the hidden item too. Okay, it must be up there on that ledge. But anyway, there's an item here. TM47 low sweep. Hmm. It's an interesting fighting type move. I'm not really too sure how it works. It's one of those new moves, so I don't really know. Did my repel wear off? I think it did. Better check it out. Uh, nope, not Psychic Gem, Max Repel. Oh, no, 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 I guess it didn't. My bad. Wait, did it say I was on it? No, it didn't. Okay, so, well, unless the hidden item's here. No, okay. Alright, so now we're gonna take this surf pond here. It's a huge pond, and it just leads around to the, like, big item of this dungeon. Now repels effect world. Oh man, I didn't mean to do that. I could have used my shortcut. So now I gotta turn this stupid thingy back on. Whatever. All that shit's over on the islands, dude. Leave me alone with that. Okay, so there's gonna be like a Yeah, there's like rocks in the middle of this pond, it's weird. Okay, Max Elixir here, very nice. And then the main item of this dungeon just sitting up here on a pedestal is... TM-52 Focus Blast. That's basically like the strongest fighting type move. It's got shit accuracy, but it is the strongest move. So there you go, if that's your cup of tea. All right, and now we can get on a little spit of island here. Looks like there's a hidden item up on that ledge. All right, there's some stairs here. Sorry that this is, like, the most boring commentary you've ever heard in your life, but I just gotta, like, figure out where I am. Oh, look. Oh, man, I was hoping for a flying gym. Still haven't even gotten one of those. Oh, look, it's a slow flake. Level 11. Really, I can't get down here with Surf and the wild Pokemon are still gonna be level 11? Fuck you. Okay, oh, also there is an item down here. There's so many hidden items in this place. It's a Mystic Water. Oh, that's pretty cool. That powers up water type moves. I think we already have one of those, but whatever. Alright, now here's where all the battles are going to come. There's a bunch of battles over here. All these chicks are lined up together. Okay, this rock's got something. Hyper Potion. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, there's also... Uh, this item here, and there's a dive ball, and there's also a hidden item over here, it looks like. Or not. That must be lower. Alright, so... Now we go down here where all the battles are. Oh, are you not gonna fight me? Yeah, she is. Okay, so let's just fight her. Oh, trainer, do you want to learn a better lesson? I want to learn why you're sitting down here in the dark with... Uh, another chick and a dude. You guys having a threesome down here? By the way your legs are open, I would assume yes. Alright, it's a god! Uh, fun fact, I actually used one of these guys on my team my first run through. I think I already talked about Timber and Girder and all those guys. So yeah, I used Timber, Girder, and... Um, I don't think I ever got Conkler. No, I did get Conkler. I think I traded him. Because I had black and white, so I just traded him over. Wow, I just got fucked up. Lovely. The only Pokemon I actually give two shits about leveling up here, and he dies. Wow, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. And it's a Pokemon that I should be super effective against. Alright, so now we get to look at Slowflake in battle. He's pretty dope. I mean, look at this guy. He's crazy. Um, So remember, he's now ground and steel, so any steel type moves you give him will have stab. Also, he has much more resistances now, so that's good, I guess. There we go, Salk. Um, I will leave Slowflake in, he's kind of low level. I should use my revive on Dookie Face, Avion, but I guess I will do that later. Eat it, Brick Break, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, the one thing we do gain with the part Steel type is also a fighting weakness and a fire weakness. So, that's pretty sad, that is pretty sad. Get my ass kicked by these guys down here. I didn't think they'd be this high level. I mean, hell, the wild Pokemon down here were level 11, for Christ's sake. There we go. 
Alright, unfortunately, Slowflake, I am not going to be able to revive you, but I am going to have to revive Sir Avion with my last revive. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I had another revive, yo. Uh, excuse me? Unless it's in this pack for some reason. Uh, oh no, you know what? I used them both. I used them on Crash and Avion, so I don't. So all these battles down here are pretty much useless to me. Oh, I don't want to come back down here, though. Fuck, I guess I'm just gonna have to give somebody else these levels. Somebody else these levels. Alright, Fire Kong, it's up to you then, buddy. Oh, what waste. I could be giving this experience to Avion. You know what? Oh, I could use the Rokandi on him, and that might bring him back to life. But then he'll be low HP, and I don't have any healing items. Or, you know what? Didn't I find a Hyper Potion in here? Yeah, I'll try that after this battle. Alright, these guys, I'm no longer fucking with you guys. Sorry, but Flare Blitz. Go eat a dick, Gurr. That's for killing my fucking Avion, you douche. Bitch. Ha ah, ah, ha ah. ha. Firecorn. Bro. Whatever. Weak. Look at this fat red guy. I am the superior. I'm the alpha red Pokemon here, so get out of here, bitch. Your three fingers. What are you gonna do with three fingers? You ain't gonna, you ain't gonna throw nobody. The only thing you're gonna throw is your dignity in the trash. Okay, there we go. Alright, now before we fight douche nozzle make snozzy pants here. I don't want to use this ray candy because I'm pretty sure because it's, you know, it's a rare candy, first of all. And second thing, it might be bad against... Oh, you know what? Fighting gem. Hell, why not? Uh, Crash isn't holding anything right now. Rare candy, rare candy, rare candy. Where's my rare candy? It's a candy that is rare. Where the hell is it in this? There it is, yeah. Oh, I've got two. Look at that. It did level his ass up. Oh, now he's going to try to evolve. Sorry, buddy. And no can do. Two more levels. Two more levels, pal. Err! He's like, God damn it. You know what? Let's use the other one. Yeah, why not? Get him that much closer. I just need fly, man. I need fly so bad. Yes. All right. No more fail. There's no more possible failing at that that can be done. Um. Yeah. Let's use a hyper potion here. I also picked up a max potion. All right, Avon, and this should be the battle where you do your thing. This could be it. This could be the battle where our team becomes awesome. Well, our team's already awesome, but. Oh, no, 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 no. I need to turn on the dousing machine. Alright, and let's do this. Competitive eating is one thing I'm good at. You know, it seems Asians are always good at competitive eating. I'm not, like, trying to make a fat joke or anything, but really, like, if you ever watch, like, the TV shows or stuff that have, like, host eating contests, like, hot dog eating contests, like, there's that one Asian guy that can eat, like, 39 hot dogs in a minute. And it's like, holy shit. And all these guys, they're not, like, fat either. They're, like, super buffed out. It's crazy. They're like, you know, they can, they're just, they just have like expanded stomachs or something. They can expand it if they want, but they're still like super ripped and stuff. It's crazy. I don't know what it is. Apparently it's just a sport I don't understand. I would have, I would assume the bigger belly you have, the better competitive eating, but I guess since competitive eating is like a timed event. Ow, please no. Thank you. Now die. Sock. Oh, so close. Oh, he's got a sock and a throw. This guy's nuts. Might be in trouble here. If I could Oko this guy, it'd be great. But I can't because I have the lucky egg on, so that's not going to happen. Wow, this guy has a lot more defense. Oh, I'm fucked. I'm dead. There goes Avion again, and now I've got nothing left to bring him back. So we're just going to have to level him up after this place. That's okay. I don't think he would have gotten the experience anyway. Uh, it's yeah, Fire Kong. Excuse me, Fire Kong? And yeah, let's Flare Blitz, because I'm leaving this place after this battle anyway to heal. So fuck you. You Flare Blitz, bitch. Apparently Throw is the extremely more defensive one of these guys. That would make sense since he's fatter. Which means he's bulkier. Alright, cool. So fuck these guys. Now I just need to find the items that I came for. 
hidden item somewhere around here. Uh, it's up on that ledge. Okay, let's go back. Ah, oh, god damn it. No, I didn't want to press that item, that button. That was the wrong goddamn button. Yikes, man, I can't get my shit together. I hate menu navigation. I hate it. Yes, dowsing machine. Show me where that last item is. It's over here. There it is. Now, what was this item I had to work? Oh, it was a revive. Well, look at that. That would have been nice, huh? That would have been nice to have beforehand. All right, so that's everything in this cave. There's nothing. There's no other floors here. That's it. So, does somebody still have dig? Does Noki still have dig? Yes, he does. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of this place, yo. Oh, man, dig looks cool when you have flash not on. All right, so that is another surf location down. We now only have five more places to go. Five more. Can I get on my bike, please? That would be great. Nope, not dowsing machine bike. This guy's going to say, scope, wait. No, he's not. <laughs> Good. He's a douche anyway. All right, so let's heal up. Avion's only one level from the faded moment we've been waiting for. Oh my god, I'm at 26 minutes. Holy shit. Okay, so I'm going to heal. And then next episode, guys, we are going to continue with the surf exploration. Our next destination is Lost Lorn Forest. That's right, Lost Lorn Forest. So, I will see you guys then. I guess I'll be in Nimbasa City. Peace out.